Wondering how to create an Instagram carousel with Canva? In this Instagram carousel tutorial, you'll learn how to use Canva to make a carousel post on Instagram. So let's get right into this Canva Instagram carousel tutorial on how to design an Instagram carousel in Canva, be it a seamless carousel in Canva, or a regular Instagram carousel with Canva. First off, if you don't have a Canva account yet, just click on the link in the description box below to sign up for free. Once you've logged in to your Canva account, click on the search bar up top and search for a carousel Instagram post. Once that option populates, click on it. Canva has a number of Instagram carousel templates that you can choose from, or you can click on Create a Blank Carousel Instagram Post up top to create your Instagram carousel with Canva from scratch. You can even filter the Instagram carousel templates by theme, style, and color. Once you've located an Instagram carousel template in Canva that you wish to customize, such as this beige, pink, step-by-step -step educational seamless Instagram carousel post, click on it to edit it. Just like with any Canva template, you can click on any of the existing elements of your Instagram carousel design and then on the options that appear on the panel up top to edit them. For instance, you can change the text so that it says how to create an Instagram carousel with Canva, and change the colors of the circles to your brand colors. Since I'm a Canva Pro user, I can add my own brand kit with my brand colors to Canva. If you want to know how to customize those, make sure to watch my video on what is a Canva brand kit and how to customize a Canva Pro brand kit. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. The best part is that at the bottom of the color picker, you can click on Change All so that all of the circles in a particular color change to the color you choose. As the name of this Instagram carousel mentions, this is a seamless Instagram carousel post. This means that when someone scrolls through your Instagram carousel, the elements on each page directly connect to the next without any extra work on your end. Feel free to edit all of the existing elements on this Instagram carousel post or to add your own from the options on the left-hand side panel. For an entire walkthrough of all of the available elements in Canva that you can add to your Instagram carousel design, make sure to watch my video on how to use Canva. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. Once you're happy with how your Instagram carousel post looks like, rename your Instagram carousel design up top, such as to Instagram carousel, and then click on the download button. Select the file type, in this case either PNG or JPG, and then click on download at the bottom to save the Instagram carousel you created with Canva to your computer. To upload this Instagram carousel you created with Canva to Instagram, you can either transfer the images you saved on your computer to your mobile device. For a detailed walkthrough of how to do that, Make sure to watch my video on how to transfer photos from iPhone to Mac. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. Or open up the Instagram carousel design in the Canva app on your mobile device and save them directly to your photo gallery. Now open up your profile on Instagram, click on the plus sign up top, and then on post. Click on the multiple post option on the right hand side, Select all of the posts you saved from Canva that are part of your Instagram carousel, and then follow the steps as you normally would to add a post to Instagram. If you're serious about creating an Instagram carousel with Canva, make sure you sign up for a free Canva account by clicking on the link in the description box below. Check out our Canva Tutorials playlist for even more Canva tips and tricks as well as our free cheat sheet with brilliant tools that you should use below this video 
to learn more about how to save time and boost your productivity in your online business. Leave a comment below and let me know if you'll be using Canva to make a carousel post on Instagram. If you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so that you can navigate the tech side of online business with ease and stay tuned for our next video, which is about how to use Canva to create a website for free. As you wait for our next video to go live, check out these two videos I have right here, and I'll see you in my next video.